Howdy folks, how's it going? Welcome to My Virgin Kitchen, it's Barry here. Today we are making some absolutely gorgeous strawberry and white chocolate muffins. So, so good, absolutely stonking, perfect for breakfast, perfect for lunch, perfect for any minute of any day. You will absolutely just, just, ugh, you're gonna start shimmy like that. Uh, if you wanna have a go, you're gonna need some ingredients, right? So hit pause on the video now, write these ingredients down and join in the muffin party. That sounds wrong, but, you know what I mean. All right, so the last person to like my Facebook page was Azubi Khan. Okay, that is an amazing name, Zubi. Uh, don't know where you're from, Zubi, but thank you very much. And if you're not already liking uh, the Facebook page, Facebook page? Facebook page, uh, Facebook forward slash My Virgin Kitchen, joining the fun and games and all that stuff. And here is your random postcard for this video. Okay, so just hit pause and share that on social media. Some of you guys love that. Let's crack on and make all these muffins, baby. All right. So basically for this recipe, it's all gonna come together in one big bowl. The first thing we're gonna do is grab our sugar and just pour it in like that, all right, confidently looking at the camera. Find a camera and just stare at it as you pour. Up, up to you. And I'm just gonna push in my butter. And all we're gonna do then is if you haven't got an electric whisk, you're gonna have to do this manually. <clears throat> grab an electric whisk and cream together our butter and sugar, baby. So our sugar and butter is now nice and combined. We're now adding in both of our eggs. Not just one on its own, it'd be lonely. Both eggs, please. Where's the other one? Oh, there it is. <laughs> there we go. So they're both in there together. And again, we're just gonna beat it through with our electric whisk. Alrighty, our eggs are nice and beaten and combined in there. Just about two minutes just beating that together. All we need to do now is follow up by pouring in our milk and then our teaspoon of vanilla extract. And again, mix that through. Okay folks, I'm not gonna lie, uh, but this mixture is kind of wet right now. Um, you ever notice how people, when they say, I'm not gonna lie, they normally are lying? But anyhow, I am not gonna lie, that is wet, hopefully you agree with me. Uh, what we're gonna do is thicken it up by adding in our flour. So this uh, is self-raising flour, which I'm just gonna add in batches. Uh, you can sift it in if you want to, but I'm, what I'm gonna do is do it in, th uh, in threes, in thirds, in threes, and tres, and just fold it through uh, with a spatula. So just lift it in, like so, yeah. Fantastic, and with all that flour in there, it's now time to pimp up our muffins by adding in our chocolate chips and our strawberry chunks. Folks, I hope you'll agree, it is looking absolutely stonking with those ingredients merged in there. It kind of reminds me of Wimbledon, like the whole strawberries and cream thing. I want to grab my tennis racket, but instead of a tennis racket, I'm going to grab my cupcake tray, uh, which is lined uh, with some of these like muffin cases. These are quite fancy ones, but you can use any ones you like. So all I'm going to do is fill them up. Yeah. Alrighty then folks, so I've just whacked those in the oven. I'm gonna say roughly 15 minutes, might take a couple of minutes more until they're nice and firmed all over. Uh, I need six, I, I need six? I made six uh, muffins, but I've got enough mixture left uh, to probably do another two. So you at least get eight out of this mixture if you are having a go. So anyhow, let's see what they turn out like. Oh my goodness guys, the smell in here is absolutely phenomenal. Freshly baked muffins. I've let them cool down, but they're still slightly warm. I actually took 22 minutes in total, so they're nice and browned uh, on the tops. And I actually put two tablespoons in each cupcake case, just in case you're interested. But it's looking so good. I wanna eat them right now, just while they're still warm. So why don't I do just that? Yes, that's a great idea. I'm just gonna take a big old bite in right now. Oh my God. I need to show you this. The white chocolate has gone all gooey and melted in the middle, and also those strawberries which has softened up from the heat, and of course the warmth from the muffins, freshly baked anyway. When I bit through it, it is just absolutely stonkingly good. I'm sorry, stonking is the word today. It is amazing, so I really hope uh, you give these a go. Send me a picture at My Virgin Kitchen if you do. Just like any of my other recipes, if you try those and put your own spin on them, I love to see your pictures. So that's it then guys. Uh, check out my last video if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye.